The USDA has introduced a new rule under the Packers and Stockyards Act targeting how injury to competition should be interpreted in lawsuits brought forward by producers against packers and processors. The Fair and Competitive Livestock and Poultry Markets proposed rule would clarify the interpretation of unfair under the Packers and Stockyards Act and spell out in more detail conduct prohibited under the law. What does that mean? Does it require that you prove the unfairness to the entire industry? Or is it possible that there may be circumstances and individual factual circumstances where the unfairness occurs to one or uh, a handful of producers? Uh, is this notion of competitive injury, does it require that the entire marketplace be impacted? Or is it possible for participants eventually and ultimately to have the opportunity to prove a Packers and Stockyards case? Specifically, the rule would clarify competitive injury or injury to competition. There is an opportunity for unfairness to be couched in terms of individual harm. An individual producer who might be able to establish uh, under the elements of the new rule that the harm was specific to their operation uh, and constituted a violation of Packers and Stockyards. At the same time, we obviously will continue to work uh, in terms of making sure that if there is injury to the entire marketplace, that that too represents a violation uh, of the Packers and Stockyards Act. The secretary said there's an imbalance between producers who enter contracts with packers and processors and may be left holding significant liabilities on their operations, all without protection. So in combination, what we've done is we've expanded transparency and made it easier for farmers to understand the deals that they're entering into and who they're contracting with. We made sure that they couldn't be discriminated against or retaliated against. We made sure that a tournament system would operate fairly and that there would not be any specific deductions that caught farmers by surprise. And today we provide a, an enforcement tool uh, that I think will provide for greater balance in the relationship between farmer and integrator. All of this is designed in combination with the resources and investments we've made to create the opportunity for more new and better markets. The proposed rule drew praise from groups like the National Farmers Union. For its part, NFU has helped push the Biden administration with its Fairness for Farmers campaign on issues like this. Conversely, the Meat Institute, representing the meat packing industry, criticized USDA, claiming the proposal would set meat production back by decades.